what the hell does George care about shaving his head? But you've got like beautiful Kaser standing there and you know, he doesn't know what he's gonna look like without hair. <laughs> George, Fix you are first. Have a seat in the barber chair. I was doing anything, anything I could have done to stay in the game. And I'm thinking, if you quit this, you quit the rest of your life. Oh. This will make you a soldier, George, you Jedi soldier. <laughs> We're bald. You look like the, you're, you're the you're the 47-year-old Brad Pitt. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. This may be the greatest veto competition ever, baby. All right, George. Thank you, thank you very much. Woo! Thank you, thank you. Your turn, Kay. You can jump out if you want. Nobody's gonna think badly of it. I'm still shaking my head like, what the hell have I gotten myself into? I had to win that veto. The continuity of, of our plan was at stake. I'm just gonna do it as quickly as possible. We'll fix it later, okay? All done. I was actually a little verklempt. It was like a big sacrifice in this weird way. You look good, Kaser. So anyway, Kaser is now bald. Well, guys, you've made it through all of these miserable tasks. However, it's just not good enough to win this week's veto. So we're going to a tiebreaker. Here's the question. There are only 60 days left in the Big Brother house. How many consecutive days would you be willing to go on slop to win this veto comp? The person who writes down the highest number of days wins the power of veto. These people have no idea what it feels like to be on the slop. And I'm looking at chicken doors like, you don't know what you're doing, you're gonna beg for mercy. All right, you guys, it's time to reveal your answers. Kaser, 15. I'll take them all. George, 60 days. Oh. Congratulations, Chicken George. And the golden power of veto goes to Chicken George. This veto really was how bad do you want it? And Georgie wanted it bad enough that he is eating slop for the next 60 days in the Big Brother household. George winning the power of veto, it is what it is. I haven't even really had time to think of another strategy right now. Thankfully, the veto ceremony is not for another day and a half, so I have all tomorrow to figure out where I want to go from here. Thank you, Thank you Congratulations, Georgie. You know, I'm thinking, okay, this morning while I'm gone home, and all of a sudden, I'm back. <laughs> I'm staying <laughs> for at least another week.